<laughs> Welcome back, everyone. It's Abdallah here with another exciting episode of Link's Awakening on Game Boy Color. Nintendo 3DS, Link's Awakening DX. We've got a very, very exciting episode ahead of us. Thanks so much for coming. I haven't seen you in so in such a long time. Like, what's the deal? As I grab my awesome water bottle, my super branded water bottle here, The Legend of Zelda, Link's Awakening. Mmm. Brought to you by water. <laughs> Yo, we're like double branded over here. Like, what is this? Windfish shirt? Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening water bottle? Dude. Poster child, just saying. Let's hit this. Uh, so today's episode, we are going to do the Eagle's Tower. We're going to beat up the evil eagle and Sans Undertale, the skeleton. You guys know him, the guy that's in Smash Bros. right now. Sans Undertale is going to make an appearance twice. Um, other than that, we're going to get the Organ of Evening Calm, and we're going to have a good time. So, any Undertale fans? Yo, what if I told you that Sans was in The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening before he was in Earthbound? <laughs> oh, before he was in Earthbound, you guys. So you guys put that two and two together. Anyway, uh, yeah, so what's happening? It's good to see you guys. Thanks for coming. This was $21. This bottle was $21. <laughs> at the Nintendo booth over at, um... PAX West. And the Nintendo Switch one, with, with the Nintendo Switch logo that was like pink, it was $20. So, like, it was the same bottle. This one just had a dollar more, because it's Zelda. Okay. Anyway, let's go. Let's do 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 And let's get on out of here. Let's do 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 it. Uh, we're gonna go... And we're gonna actually put this song to good use. Yeah, yeah, $21. I mean, it is a Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening water bottle. I mean, come on now. And it is BPA free. So there's that. You're paying for quality. <laughs> uh, it was cool. Nintendo oh my gosh. Yo, I'm out of bombs, man. What are you doing spending bombs like that? Lonk? Looking like a lonk over here, buddy. Um, anyway, so, what was I gonna say? I don't know, I was just kinda messing around. Um, water bottle... Oh yeah, it was the first time that Nintendo actually had a merch booth at their booth. In, um... At PAX. Or any, like... Any show that I remember, that I've been to. I've been to a lot of Nintendo shows. Uh, out in conventions, so... Anyway. Whoa, what do you know? Dun -dun 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 -dun. Go! Hit and run! Alright, anyway. Oh, it's a pile of bones! What are we gonna do with a pile of bones? I don't know, do we learn a song from, uh, what's his name? Maybe. We're gonna breathe life into a dead pile of bones! You got, uh, what's his name? Kojiro? Kojiro. <laughs> wow, the rooster has recovered. It seems very friendly. Yo, Kojiro's making it back. How many guys, where is Kojiro from? You guys know Kojiro? Give me that chicken and fly! Fly me to the moon, child. Anyway, we got some work to do with Kojiro over here. Why walk when you can fly? Yeah. Yeah, infinite flight, baby. I wish you could just fly me over these boulders. Ugh, dang. Why did I think for a second that that would have worked? Not Komajiro. You yokai fan. Kojiro is the, uh, it's the name of the blue cuckoo. From Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Was it not? Remember there was the guy in the, the Lost Woods? And he's like, yo, can you find my chicken for me? It's blue. And then boom, you find the blue chicken. It was part of a trading sequence for something. I don't remember. I'd really have to play that game again. You know, I've never done this before. This is actually cool. Yeah! Wee! 
Yo, you ever just say we? Oh, dang, make that big 20 rupees. Uh, you know, I don't feel bad. I honestly don't feel bad because you di if you didn't do this, you would have been locked out of the content. You would have absolutely been locked out of the content if you gave away the chicken. Dang, dude. You dang dirty dude, what the heck? All right, well, that was cool. I thought I'd get like something awesome about that, but we didn't, so whatever. All right, Kojiro. Was that part of the big Goron sword quest? Oh. But yeah, that was his name. Dude, I should have quizzed you guys. Oh my gosh, I love quizzing you guys on random Zelda trivia that you guys don't even know about. Unless you're actually Googling behind the, uh, behind the screens over here. Like, oh man, blue chicken Zelda. Google search. Get off of me. All right, anyway, we got some work to do, so let's hit this. Yo, chicken. Yo, what'd you guys have for dinner today? I went to Shake Shack, believe it or not. There's a Shake Shack that opened up nearby. And I've heard things about Shake Shack, apparently. And believe it or not, it was good. Like for fast garbage food like that, you know, like trash food, like hamburgers and hot dogs and stuff like that. It was surprisingly good. Hoot hoot. Your path is not easy, but you are almost there. Go east. The windfish is getting restless. Yeah, don't talk to me. I know what's going on. You guys haven't had dinner yet? Come on, go get that dinner. So I had Shake Shack. I had a double Shack burger. Um, which was interesting. Man, take me across this gap. You think I'm going to equip Rock's Feather when I got a blue chicken behind me? Oh, you got another thing coming, dude. Uh, yes, this way. <laughs> you think I'm gonna equip equip Rock's Feather when I got this blue chicken? Nope! Big nope. Come here. What? Okay. I need that in my life. Oh, I know where that is. I know how to get that. Oh, check this out! Yo, you think I'm gonna hookshot across when I got a blue chicken with me? No way, dude. Stop. You're blocking the, you're blocking the view, buddy. You're blocking it. Thanks for the 50 rupees that I needed. Great. Take me across, Kojiro. We, 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 dude. You just have fun. You have fun where you can get it, right? <laughs> you think I would use the hook shot from right there? No way, man. You gotta, you gotta fly with style points. Am I right? Let's go, Kojiro. Watch his name not actually be Kojiro. Someone fact check that, please. I'm going to Chicken Man's house, right? We're doing Chicken Man right now? I don't, you know, I don't think we're doing Chicken Man. Uh, I think we're going another way. I'll go up and say hi to Chicken Man, right? And I want to see if I could, I can bother him by attacking his chickens. <laughs> no, this is not the way. Oh, man. No, dude, this is absolutely not the way. All right, whatever. My bad, my bad. Run! Yeah! See ya, buddy! Good music, too, by the way. This is actually one of my favorite tunes. Okay, I want to see a show of hands. Oh, dang. Hold on, hold on, hold the phone. Was there not something over here? Give me that piece of land right there. You kidding me? Sharks, watch out, Kojiro. Oh, Kojiro. Why are we here? Oh, yeah, this. All right, this is actually kind of cool. I'll show it to you guys. In a minute. In a hot minute. Check this out. Uh, what was I going to say? Show of hands, how many of you guys are going to be purchasing the Nintendo Switch version of Link's Awakening? Show of hands. Curiouser and curiouser. Yeah, this way. Puzzles, man. There we go. Wait, what? Wait, they're all 20 rupees? 
Really? That that's what we're doing here. I guess I need them. I'm at max rupees, like I don't really need them. I should have went and bought a whole bunch of bombs. I should have gone on a spending spree. Take me away, Kojiro. Okay, so a lot of you guys are uh, gonna be picking up this game. Good. So here's the thing, right? Here's why I ask. Um, everything that we're doing in this game, you guys are gonna have to know how to do. If you guys are gonna be wanting to 100% this entire game. So all these chests that we're getting rupees in, that we don't necessarily need rupees for, uh, you're gonna need to open them. Just calling it right now. So make sure you guys take notes of what we're doing. Sure, I'm playing this old game, but let me tell you, the, uh, the remake is very true to the original. Very, very true. Almost too true. To a point where you're questioning why you're spending 60 bucks on it. I got a review that I'm working on that'll elaborate more on that, so stay tuned. No spoilers, man. No spoilers, dude. No spoilers. I got- I got it. I got you guys. Man! I want to talk about it, but I, I can't. I can't talk about it. Talk about what? I don't know. Okay, anyway, we're gonna do some flying like our middle name is Ryan. Alright, let's- I think we're flying this way? Alright. Get this ugly looking thing out of here. You ready, Kojiro? You ready? This is your one- one of your only usages in the game. Take me away, dude. We. Oh dang, Kojiro doesn't do it here. What? What am I? What am I missing? I'm sorry. Hello. <laughs> All right, yo, blue chicken does not do work here. All right, well let's 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 just go around. Here we go. Oh, what do you mean? What do you actually mean? We. All right. Can I, can I leave now? Thank you. Alright, we need a little bit of healing. And I should have gone and bought some bombs, man. I, I guess it's not too late to warp back. It's not too late. I mean, I could if I wanted to. Anyway, in case you need healing, here we go. A great fairy statue. Heals all of your wounds. The, the music is good. Um, Jesse Urkalani. The music is really good. Talta Heights music is very good. You like it. The music is great. Um, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I guess I could talk about that, right? Yeah. Dude, where's the key at? I don't have the key. Ah, I thought the key was this way. Mama Mia. I don't have the key. I'm just like talking my head off. Can a guy get out of here? I don't have the key and I'm going to Eagle's place. Okay, great, great, great. So let's just pretend the previous thing just never happened. And uh, we're gonna... <laughs> did I warp over here? I did, right? I did the do 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 do. Okay, so here we go. So that whole section, watch. I just came right out of here, right? I just came out with Kodro. So that whole little section that I did over there. <laughs> I guess I did do it, right? Because I did show you guys what was in the chest. So that's all good. So we got to go get that key. And the only way to get the key is through this way. And I was supposed to go to the opposite side uh, whenever we were kind of going that way. So anyway. Hey, we did a little bit of sightseeing. It's cool. I get to hang out with you guys. All right, come on, man. Let's go, chicken. Take me away. Give me this. You think I'm pressing start? Nope. Ouch. Ouch. What a bully. Oh my gosh, what a bully. Oh. Dude, are you noticing that everything that I attack is like going flying? It's getting launched like I have like the power of like courage or whatever it is. It's pretty cool. I didn't realize that before. Um, in my in my blind playthrough of this game, I never got the Coholent Sword. So this is actually kind of cool that I'm experiencing it. Coholent Sword comboed with the little um, color dungeon um, 
red tunic? It's pretty cool. It's power. All right, here we are. I think this is the... Yeah, this is the room. All right, and that's the chicken man's house. Yeah, we were trying to go to the chicken man's house. This is Kojiro's room, by the way. One of his only usages. You think I'm gonna hookshot across? No way. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah! Let's go! We Check this out. Yo! Yeah, we're flying. We are absolutely flying with a chicken. Come here. Take me all the way, dude. Alright, that's the key. We need that key. You've got the bird key! Alright, give me that. Give me that bird first. Yeah! See ya! Okay, so this is exactly Kojiro, Kojiro's... I guess his second, there's only two things that you use him for, right? That one rupee that you got like 20 rupees out of, uh, and you use him for the bird key. That's really it. So, GG's. And then now we donate him to the, the chicken man. Kind of cool. But it's kind of sad, right? Like, I really like this guy walking behind me. Uh, he kind of grew on me. He was a pet, right? I resurrected him from death. You know, whole the whole like creationism thing, dude. Link's got it with his magic thing. It's Luigi, by the way. I'm a Luigi, number one. All right, wow, amazing. That rooster is actually flying. It's just like I said, eh? Have you tried to hold him over your head? Cluck, cluck. Yeah, you know what? Cluck you. Oh, yo, cluck him, man. Yeah, now what? You're not going to kick me out for abusing your chickens. What a good guy. Wow, what a good guy. What's in this chest? Wow, this is a nice chest. <laughs> so, he doesn't kick you out. Oh, that's interesting. All right, try that in the Switch version. I promise you something cool will happen. Um, What do we got? We got this key? I'm out of here, right? Let's go this way just in case. Yeah! Best music in the game. Oh, dang! Surprise, surprise. What is going on over here? You? This is all I come for. Maybe if I had a shovel, I could probably dig it. Ow, stop it. What the heck? <laughs> the one I wanted to pick up. Give me that fairy! Anyway, maybe if I had a shovel, I would dig in that one spot and maybe something would come out. I don't know. Take me across. Actually, no, you can't take me down? Alright, that's fine. Alright, so, uh, some of you guys are wondering about Kojiro. Can you bring him into a dungeon? You can't, unfortunately. You cannot. Uh, as cool as he is, he only, like I said, he only has two usages, and then you pretty much donate him to science. Or you donate him to Chicken Man. And that's it. He's gone. And no, no, his name's not really Kojiro, but that's just what I'm calling him. Mamma mia! Oh. Did you guys see Luigi, though? Dude! Dude, hold on, hold on. Terran is Mario, and Chicken Guy is Luigi! Whoa! Mind blown! Did you guys realize that? Oh, man. Hold on, hold on. Yo, Terran, the guy that gives you the shield at the beginning, kind of looks like Mario, right? Like, big stocky guy, mustache, bulbous nose. And you got a skinny guy in green! Oh, my gosh, that's so crazy. There's, Dude... Why did I not realize that? I'm a Luigi, number one. Dude, that's so cool. All right, anyway, anyway. I bet you didn't know that. And those of you guys that say you didn't know that, you're just saying that to save face. I get it, I get it. It's cool, it's cool. Your secret's safe with me. Dude, that's so insane though. I cannot believe that in my life right now. Get out of here. Who yet? Stop. Uh, we are going across this gap with a hook shoddy. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, we're back. A dinosaur story, 20 minutes in. 20 minutes getting to this place. Uh, we had some fun. We had some fun with our little blue chicken. Ah, yummy. Okay, so uh, let's, let's continue. We got some work and trust me, this is gonna be an annoying map. It is gonna be so annoying. 
And but I'll get I'll get used to it. I will watch. That's, those are the eyeballs of a skull, by the way. Can you see that design? Uh, the design of this dungeon. That's the the left eye, the right eye, the nose. It's a skull. It's kind of cool. Bet you didn't know that. Oh dang, teaching you everything about this game, dude. Just kidding. You guys know more about Zelda than me. All right, here we go. Bird key. Open up. The name's Lonk. The name's Lonk and I got a hoppin' blue bird over here. Somehow an entire structure rotates. Only the work of fiction in someone's mind, am I right? Level 7, Eagle's Tower. Okay, so uh, our blue chicken is no more. Say goodbye to Kojiro in the comments. See ya, buddy. Thanks so much for all of your help. Uh, we do have a really, really annoying um, map over here that I'm going to attempt. I'm going to simply attempt to remember how to do this one, so... It's annoying in a way that you gotta play escort. You gotta play like escort mission with one of the like the the, the gigantic ball, whatever it is. Oh, nimbly dodge that shot. Uh, I'm gonna go boomerang. Yeah, you gotta do a little bit of an escort mission, which is kind of annoying, but it's okay. And I'll show you guys a, a, a cool trick. Check this out. So that right there, that's the um, that's a mirror shield. You can do this. Which you're not supposed to do. So that's a sh you're supposed to do some long, circuitous thing to make your way all the way around. But if you had the boomerang, dude, that's a free shortcut. So there's that. Yay. So now we got the mirror shield. Hey, what do you know about it? I am I know that we need to now move. That's pretty cool, right? Oh, dang. Here we go. Yep, this is the beginning of the uh, escort mission. Mm -hmm. So we got this ball. We're gonna throw it over. Ah, that works, yeah, sure. We'll, we'll do that. Um, I don't need a sword. We'll do this. Who it? Oh, oh, oh! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, 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 um. Yeah, sorry. I needed to. Uh, I need to save because, uh, believe it or not. Um, you can somehow get the ball stuck and hard lock your game. Hard lock or soft lock? I, I think it's hard lock. Maybe soft lock. Yeah, so you should definitely save the game before you actually go into the spot. Um, and then the gimmick here is bringing this ball all the way around so that you break the pillars. You break the pillars of... There's four pillars, and you have to break them. So I saved right there. What is this going to do to me? Hey! What was that noise? Is it just me, or is the volume getting crackly? If the in-game sound effects are getting crackly... I can turn off the game. Okay, so that's just me. Okay, good. Because I was playing this game for like a good five hours in a row. Hey, there's Kirby, by the way. Let's go say hi to Kirby. Ouch, what the heck? All right, fine. I won't say hi to Kirby. It's like, yo, his name's not Kirby. Get out of here. Anyway, I was playing this game for blind for like good five hours going through like the whole thing on a train ride or on a plane ride. And um, the audio after a long time of playing it without stopping, it got really crackly and unbearable. It's weird. Okay, so these dudes, uh, let's go with black. Oh, yeah? That, that's exactly it. Good job. We're gonna go after red. These things rotate too fast! Ugh, oh, fail. Yuck! Don't you do it! Don't you do it! Stop moving! Oh, by a millisecond! Come on! Go! 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 Thank you! My goodness! 
Anyway. So, yeah, we're, we're moving. We're moving and grooving. We're taking this little ball with us where we need to go. Uh, you can't throw it diagonally, so I'm going to have to throw it there. And then I'm going to have to go all the way around and pick it up somehow. Did you hear that? You heard that. Tell me I'm not going crazy. Kirby! Ah, Kirby! Oh, he's going to inhale me! Oh my gosh, he's actually going to inhale me. What do we do? Throw a bomb at him? I've never battled Kirby. Oh! Eat it! What do you mean Kirby doesn't eat a bomb? Get out of here. What do you mean Kirby doesn't eat a bomb? That's redonkulous. Kirby doesn't eat a bomb. Okay, you guys hear it. I'm not going nuts. Ooh! Alright, that's fine. Yowie. I need to do one of two things. chill right here. Don't touch me, other thing. Oh, you heard it, right? Ugh. Yo, this is Game Boy. That Game Boy sound effect. Alright, it's getting a little nasty, but I assure you, Okay, so that's two pillars down. <laughs> this, these, these looks on my face right over here are like, oh, where the heck do I go? Bring that back up and then make my way across again. I'm gonna go down this, no, I can't go down. Dude, come on, I don't have time for this. Oh. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right. Whatever. No. Oh, anyway, we're back. Ah, uh, dude. I I said I should just fall right here. You know what? Here, you know what? I'm going. I'm going. See ya. See ya. Goodbye. I needed to go down. Let me go. See ya. Hey! Yeah, that's what we needed. Rupee. A little crackly. Bear with it, okay? It only gets worse. <laughs> it's like if you've played the game for X amount of hours without, like, starting and resetting, the sound effects get crackly. I don't, I don't know if that's a known issue or what, but... Anyway, there's a couple things I have to do. Uh, not this, for sure. It's feeling a little crunchy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very crunchy. Is it down? Yeah, okay, that's where uh, Kirby and the Goomba is. Kirby! There we go, I just needed this, thank you. Okay, it's a bird beak. Don't need it, but for the sake of completion, we're gonna go grab it. Okay, bird beak. Buck beak? If the volume gets unbearably bad, someone please notify me in the chat so I can actually reset this game. Yo, dude, what is your problem? Why did he do that to me? Alright. Nope. Kirby! Okay, here we go. I'm going to... I got that one. 
I need to go get my ball. Where's my ball at? Ah, where'd my ball go? Should be over here, right? Yeah, yeah, it's up, it's up there. Uh, so I gotta go bring the ball over, and I gotta break this thing. See this? See how, like, the ball can get stuck in between loading zones? Oh my gosh, scary. Yeah, with my nose. The nose knows. Yeah, that's our what? Third pillar? Second pillar? No. There we go. Uh, I need to drop down and go around. There's a little stairway that we're going to go meet that ball. As you guys saw that stairway. Ugh. 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 Sorry. Yo, boomerang. Cheese! Say cheese! Ugh. There we go. <laughs> I love that. I do have a key, right? Please tell me I got a key. What do you mean? No, I need that. I actually need a key. All right. Um, 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 big ums here. Yo, this is big ums. I'm not liking big ums. Unless I can do this. No, I don't need a key, man. Forget that, dude. Check this out. Yo, who needs a key? Get over here. I'm like, no, I need a key. No, you don't, fool. All right. I don't think I need to do this part yet. Oh, 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 okay, 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 check this out. I'm gonna do this. Yeah, yeah, I know where to go. Uh, check this out, check this out. Watch, 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 watch. You watching this? Hello! <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. All three of them, man. You don't see that very often. Look at this big boy. Yo, what a tan, man. Yeah, keep on hitting me with those. See what happens. See what honestly happens to you guys, cowards. Whatever. I'm not gonna allow this fool to get me. Keep on hitting me with those fireballs. See what happens, dude. Key. See what- Ugh, crunchy. See what happens, he says. You know, we're doing pretty well for uh, a dungeon that I feel is the most annoying one. I think we're doing pretty well. I, I think I broke three of the pillars so far. Surprisingly, there's not that much backtracking if you know what you have to do. Three bombs. You check this out right here. You check that out right now. Three bombs. Imagine if I didn't have a single bomb. That's so clutch. Three bombs. Oh, very crunchy. Oh. Wee! Watch, one bomb. You got a bomb. Way to go. We did it. Is this crunchy music now? Okay, so now the question is, um, where exactly does one go? Now that I've gotten all the pillars destroyed. Yes, I will, I will absolutely reset before we go into the boss fight. That's a great idea. You know, I'm just gonna do 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 because I'm right here. Let's just do that. 
Yeah, you guys cool with that? Alright, cool. Hey, check this out. Alright, so level 7, Eagle's Tower. I'm gonna do two things. I'm gonna double save. We're going to create a restore point, yes. Okay, cool. Cool, you guys are fine with that. Um, and now... We're gonna save and quit. It's still crunchy sounding. Yeah, that's bad. That's the best music. Nice one. nice one! I'm telling you, the Jibanyan skin on 3DS, there's no better skin. Yeah! Now with 50% less crunch! Okay, here we go. I do have... Yeah, yeah, we're done. We're D-U-N done. Okay, this is good. Okay, cool, cool. We're in this. Uh, now, I just have to jog my memory and see where uh, specifically. Ouch, dude. The heck? One and a half hearts for that? You're crazy. I Yeah, there we go. Less crunchy. All right, excellent, excellent, excellent. Uh, there is one chest that I do want to show you guys really quick. I think it's going to be another Stacy's Tracy's Medicine, so let's jump in here. I'm telling you, like, I I tweeted this out earlier. I said, does anyone else have, a, like, any issues with this? Like, is this only me? But, like, the more you play it without turning it off, it gets real crunchy. Weird. It was to a point where I didn't realize how bad it was. I think I have to use the key here. I don't know, I got two keys, so let's use one here. This allows you to jump over. I don't remember where... Uh, hmm, I think I do. There's no point in putting that key in there. I think it's over here. Yeah, throw a bone, I dare you. Okay, anyway. Yo! I'm racking my brain now. Uh, it's kind of frustrating. I think it's this way. Yeah, I think it's this way. Let's see. Maybe it's not this way. Goombabwe? Kirby? What room is it? Eat me! Okay, 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 here we go. That's not the room. One of these rooms allows you to go to the third floor. Ugh. Eagle's Tower, Eagle's Tower, Eagle's Tower, Eagle's Tower, Eagle's Tower, Eagle's Tower, uh huh, mirror, oh, southwest, hit the crystal, go up, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, okay. We gotta go find Sans the skeleton, dude. I promised you guys Sans, so let's go find him. I think I know where he is. I think he's gonna be this way. Is this where the, um, nasty dude is? Yeah, there we go, okay. Yep. Sans the skeleton. There we go! That's it. Come on, dude! I found the way, but now it's like I gotta go, I gotta go hit a switch. So let's, let me go hit a switch really quick. See ya! I'm gonna go down, I know where the switch is at, and then I know where to go. Okay, got it. So it's the bottom most path. Yeah, check that out. I didn't need to do that, but hey, check it. Okay, you know what? Eagle Tower, it's not that bad. It's not as bad as I remembered it. 
Dang, lasers. Fire the laser! Alright, anyway. Ah! I can't go this way. I have to go around the other way. So there's there's two things that I have to do here. So I gotta hit that switch, and I gotta make sure that this is the, um... The path that is chosen for us. And then I gotta go this way, and then I gotta go upstairs, and I gotta go to the south. The southmost room. Please tell me this is up. Dude, what? Goombabwe. Dude, what? <laughs> Come on, Schmelda, what is going on with this game? Mm. Leave me alone! Leave Brittany alone! Alright, anyway, what? Yes! I guess this is I guess this is cheesing it. Here, this'll work. Check this out. Hello! Yeah, okay. So I mean we kinda cheesed it? Maybe you're supposed to do it that way, I don't know. Don't touch me. Don't. Don't right now. I'm not ready for it. And this is the blocked room. That's the room I gotta go in. Huh. Here we go. Hello? Cool, cool, cool. Uh, I think I could go around. Yeah, I think this is aroundable. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, cool. We made it. Oh, do you know what? I could have just gone on this switch. Dang, dudes. All right, all right. So I was going some crazy roundabout way, but I forgot that there's a switch right here. So as long as orange is up, you're ready to go. I could have gone two rooms over. Or, you know what? I could have just gone right there. <laughs> it's so bogus. Oh my gosh, there was a switch right there and I didn't even realize it. That's so funny. Anyway, that's cool, dude. That's cool. We're at the end anyway, so it doesn't matter. I showed you some fun ways of doing it. And we're having fun while we're here, so let's just go. So, I can do a couple ways. Uh, there's those guys with little masks. Um, yeah, there's a couple things I can do. Check this out. Uh, we gotta go find Sans the Skeleton. There he is! Hey, run! Think you can take me? Think you can take me? <laughs> Who says that? Alright, boys, get this punk out of my face! Yo, determination, come here. Attack! You dirty rat! You beat my brothers! You'll pay! I'll never forget you! You? Why did he stutter with the letter K? Oh, maybe he's like, instead of saying the word kill? Hmm, I don't know. Boop, 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 boop. Ugh. I don't know. I, I don't know why he stuttered with the K. Maybe Japanese translation or something? I don't know. Some of you guys are going to tell me about that. Okay, so there's a nightmare key, ladies and gents. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. We're good. Do I need to hit that? Uh, maybe I'll just hit it for that for the sake of it. It's there. Might as well hit it. Goombabwe. So I mean, we could we could essentially end the level right here because we don't necessarily need to do these other rooms. Like, there's no point. I, I'll just go do it. Whatever. Ow! What is your problem? Like, there's no point in these rooms at all. It's like, you could just go straight to the, uh, straight to the boss. There's no point in that. Uh, is there a room above? Yeah, I guess there's a room above. We're gonna go. There's a heart piece that I gotta get. I gotta go- No, there's not a heart piece. Oh, there's Ugh, yuck! Stop it! <laughs> Alright, check this out. Uh, I'm gonna go beat up the slime first. Yow! Whoa, ouch! This hurts so much it does! Hung. Come here. Go ahead. Shoot me one time. That's right. Yeah, now shoot me. What do you mean? That doesn't stun you? Oh my gosh. Why am I here? I'm here for this? For the secret medicine? You're crazy. You should apply this and see what happens. Ow! Oh, oh! 
Dude, that's interesting. Okay, I was mistaken in the previous live stream. I said there was um, there was medicine in the previous live stream, and then it just stays in the chest. Um, that's apparently not the case. If you already own the medicine, um, that's it. You just you just take it and you automatically lose it, which is really intriguing to me. But whatever. I smush these guys for hearts, man. That's what a guy's got to do. Do these guys respawn? They don't. Okay. Well, we're done. I'm gonna go into the battle like with half hearts. Whatever. Doesn't really matter to me. Uh, but anyway, here we go. This is the evil eagle, guys. The evilest of all the eagles. We're gonna go over here with a little bit of so Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm gonna switch that around a little bit. Mm, yeah, we're gonna go Sword Shield. That's fine. I want to go A swiping for Sword. There's a little bit of a strategy you can do here. So Sans the Skeleton's back. Ah, bah. I'm not going to hold back. I'm going to make you wish you were never born. Dang, dude. That's fighting words. What a dude. Alright, Sans. Yo, you want some? <sighs> ah. Yeah. Oh, he's coming right at me. Yo! That was like three hits and he was down! My energy gone! I lost! But you will be lost too if the windfish wakes. Same as me! You are in his dream! Wait! Dude, that was the easiest- because we've got the- the red male comboed up with, um, with this, with the, the level 2 sword. That's so quick- and doing a spin attack? Oh my goodness. You've got the organ of evening calm. Dude, okay, so Sans dropped a really big bomb on us. If we choose to believe him. He says, you are in his dream, the windfish's dream. What does that mean? Ocarina, the music of the Ocarina. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching. Cool game, right? And I'm, uh, I'm growing more, more curious about what's going on in the background of the story of Koholint Island and why they're talking about dreams and stuff like that. What's happening? Is reality everything that it seems to be? I don't know. You're gonna have to find out. Okay, so guys, that's going to be it for our episode. All we did today was really the Eagle's Tower. We battled the Evil Eagle, and then we beat up the, or then we got the Organ of Evening Calm. There really wasn't too much to do other than showing you guys like the frog song that resurrected uh, Kojiro, uh, which is who we nicknamed him. Uh, Kojiro's gone. He's gone. Uh, I guess we can go say hi to Luigi, but I don't really want to. He's flying around in Luigi's room. Uh, but we are going to have to go back to Luigi and go towards the west side of the map on the next episode, which is going to be Turtle Rock. And then the next episode is going to be our grand finale, where we will do the Turtle Rock dungeon. I'll find all the leftover pieces of heart. I think we got a couple of them. How many are we at now? Uh, yeah, what's 0, 0 out of 12? Oh, those are the photos? Yeah, forget that. Um, yeah, so we got, we got two more heart pieces, and then we're done. Yeah. That's, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Two more heart pieces, and then we got them all, and then the seashells, we already got them, so this is good. Okay, ladies and gents, thanks so much for watching. Uh, grand finale tomorrow is gonna be around 6 p.m. Central. Make sure you guys, uh, make it. It'll be really cool to have you guys all on board, especially because everything that we're doing in this game is going to directly translate to the Nintendo Switch version, I promise you. To a T, like literally square by square, is going to be the exact same thing. So, those of you guys who want a head start on the game and kind of know what to do, you're going to want to watch these episodes. So, thanks for being here. I'll give some shout-outs to you guys, who uh, all of you guys that stuck around since the very beginning. Who are you guys? Let me know. Give me a show of uh, hand raises or a thumbs up in the comments, and then we can go from there. It'll be super cool. All right, thanks for coming. We'll see you guys tomorrow, 6 p.m., 
Uh, Shoutouts to Daniel. I remember you were here. Nintendo, what's going on? Uh, S Luna, thanks for coming. Kotetsu, Ruby, Philip, Aaron, Amethyst, Blazing Gamer, Jorge. Uh, we got Sans Undertale actually was here in the chat. The Sans Undertale. Um, who else? BWA was here. Baby Shark, uh, Gothic. Uh, who else is here? Blazing Gamer, hello. And uh, our new friend Streamlabs. <laughs> that bot's lame. Gotta get a new bot. Anyway, have a good day. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna go work on some uh, Zelda Switch stuff, and we will see you guys uh, on the next one. Make sure you guys are all subscribed for one, two, turn on notifications so that you guys don't miss a beat when we upload everything for the Nintendo Switch version of Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. I've got a lot to work on, and I'm running out of time, so I better go do that. Anyway, have a great rest of your day. We'll see you next time. Uh, have a great one. I will see you tomorrow, 6 p.m. Central. Mark your calendars, turn on your notifications. Take care. Have a good night.